Royal Navy personnel have been rehearsing their moves ahead of the Diamond Jubilee pageant, which will take place on Sunday. More than a 1,000 small ships will assemble to escort the Royal Barge down the river as part of the Jubilee celebrations. Rosie Layden went along to HMS President in London to find out what's in store. The mine hunter HMS Herworth is playing the part of the Royal Barge today to help what will be the first ever Maritime Guard of Honour practice their formation for the big day. It's quite an experience and just coming in today you can feel uh, the hairs rising on the back of your neck and a few goosebumps. Um, it is, like you say, an iconic river. Uh, this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. On Sunday, around 1,100 ships from the UK and the Commonwealth will muster on the Thames to sail with the Royal Barge from Battersea Bridge to Tower Bridge. There's been a tradition whenever there's been a jubilee that they're marked by some form of river, pa river pageant but certainly this would be the largest event we've ever seen in London. Certainly we're thinking at least for 350 years and in those times the river was twice the wide and then and only half the speed so this is going to be a unique event. And at the front of the flotilla will be the Royal Barge Guard of Honour. On the day there'll be two of these large patrol boats as well as the picket boats, Pacific Ribs and the four Royal Marine offshore raiding craft on show today. My unit 529 is a very operationally focused unit, uh, high, high tempo and uh, we're always at a state of readiness to deploy anywhere in the world so doing something on, on home waters and to be involved in something so high profile such as this is, uh, is quite an honour. We've had a lot of practice down on the River Dart uh, last couple of weeks getting a formation because although it looks quite simple it's very hard to coordinate getting all these boats in the right place at the right time and obviously as with everything ceremonial, we need to make sure we look in the park. The Navy will be taking centre stage during the pageant, but there is a supporting role for the Army. As the Royal Barge enters City of London waters, the Queen will be greeted by a ceremonial gun salute fired from the Tower of London. We fire all of the gun salutes for the City of London, whether that be royal occasions or state occasions. Um, we're firing a 41-gun salute. It's three guns, 10-second intervals, in full ceremonial dress. You know beneath the shadow of, of Tower Bridge. It's an awesome privilege. The Royal Barge Spirit of Chartwell is going to be moored in exactly this position, with a special viewing platform on board for the Queen. So this is where she's going to inspect the 1,000-strong flotilla of ships as it sails past her and underneath Tower Bridge. Rosie Layden, Forces News in London.